What's up guys, it's Xenoworks here, back with another video. I've seen the title and thumbnail. We're taking Tech Easy A Jiren and we're doing some auto battle runs against the hardest bosses of the 9th anniversary to celebrate the 9th anniversary because obviously on Global the 9th anniversary is still going on. So, you know, and Beast Gohan and the Gammas come out in a day and a half. So let me know if you guys are excited. 9th anniversary is actually uh, quote unquote finally here for y'all. So remember to summon for Beast Gohan. Hopefully you guys saved all your stones. So summon for Beast Gohan. He's the best thing in the game, even in JP right now. Um, anyway, back to what I was saying about this auto battle run. So the auto battle run we're using, obviously, uh, is the leader skill. It's the new uh, AGL Jiren, which he, he runs. His leader skill is Universe 11. Category key plus 4 in HP and attack to defense plus 200%. And then Universe Survival Saga. Category key plus 3 HP and attack and defense plus 200%. I'm not gonna lie to you, I've already made an auto battle run with this exact exact team, but the only difference with this video is we're replacing, um, what are I replace? I replaced uh, Int Android 17, the, the easy A one, that one that, you know, anyway, I replaced him with the Tech Jiren, and I decided to do obviously another uh, auto battle run, just seeing the differences with that, with Tech Jiren. And I'm gonna be honest with y'all, this tech journey is actually pretty good. Like, he's a pretty good unit, bro. Like, they have not dropped on these easy A's, y'all. Usually, you know, last year they were dropping on easy A's, but this year I feel like they're just hitting it on top of the head. I, I really like this unit. I've been using them, not in auto battle. I've actually been playing a lot of Dokkan and actually trying different bosses and stuff like that with, with this team. And he is really good. And you'll see in this video, because obviously he'll be in bad situations. And I'm not, I can't do anything about it because this is auto battle. And I, I literally was just watching, uh, biting my nails. Like, bro, no, bro. I wish I could touch the game. Pause. I wish I could, like, you know, put, put certain units in this slot and this slot and this slot, you know. But stuff happens. And I think that's what the fun is in auto battle. And in watching the auto battle video, right? Seeing the unexpected and seeing the misplays. I guess you could say, right? And being like, oh no, you're gonna die because of it. And, and me not dying or the game not letting me die. It's like, oh snap, that's very lucky. You know, I think that's why if you guys haven't checked out my videos or my channel, I do a lot of these auto battles for my Dokkan content because I kind of want to be different. It's not too different, but I still think it's different enough so you guys can come back and watch more and more and more. I'll be probably doing one of these for the ninth anniversary uh, auto battles with the uh, Beast Gohan team. So stay tuned for that and, and the Gammas. So I'm um, super excited, you know, I've been posting a lot of Dokkan lately. I'm not a Dokkan creator, but I'm, I'm, I'm not a Dokkan solely uh, content creator. I'm a Dragon Ball content creator, so I'll post anything pretty much Dragon Ball. Eventually, uh, I post a couple different type of anime videos, like for just different anime in, gen in general. And uh, I usually, I want to, I want to be a, a mixture of different animes, but as of right now, I, I will consider myself a Dragon Ball content creator, right? Correct, correct, correct. And how these videos auto battles work usually is you, you see right now I'm yapping. Literally, I yap as long as I think I can. And then about 25 minutes into the video, I will hit you with that peace sign. All right, guys, this is Xenoworks, and I'll catch you in the next video. And then, you know, I end the video. I end my commentary, and then the video goes on with no commentary, and you guys can enjoy just me not yapping anymore. Maybe you guys do enjoy me yapping because, you know, uh, Maybe I be speaking facts sometimes. I, I don't know. No, I'm only kidding. I just speak nonsense. I'm going to be honest with y'all. And um, so we're this early in the video, so I kind of want to promote this. I'm doing two different things for this channel to help it grow and, and help it uh, get a community. One is the first thing I want to promote is I'm doing a Sparking Zero tournament, y'all, when the game releases. I don't know, a week after the game releases or two weeks after the game releases. Let me know in the comment section if you're here watching this video. Let me know if in the comment section... Uh, which one should I do? By the way, you're like, why should I care? Because y'all, dun, dun, drum roll, please. I'm drum rolling in my head. By, by the way, I'm not editing in, in the video. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, uh, I'm, it's gonna be a $500 cash prize, y'all. Obviously, first place is not getting all of it. It's gonna be like uh, into placement, right? First place will probably will get the most. Second and then third. Second will get the second most of it, and third will get the third most, right? But it would all add up to $500. It's a subscriber tournament I'm doing just for you guys to help the community grow, to help obviously my viewers, my viewer account, help my uh, subscriber account, and just to, and just to have a, a community, uh, just to have a community, you know, and, and have y'all 
comment, you know, I'll probably do a live stream, I'll probably make it a solo, uh, I, I don't know yet, you know, I don't know if I can get every, uh, all the contestants together at one point and do a whole live stream, or just chop it up into videos and get, get you guys, the contestants, at certain moments when you guys are free, because I know everyone's busy, and at that moment, um, just slice it into videos and have me comment it over the videos, etc, etc, you know, but that is a thing, I'll be posting a video actually very soon, probably in a week or two, of how to enter obviously you got to be subscribed and I'll probably do like make a video and you have to like comment something right all right, right, right I'll probably make that in like two to three weeks so I can get that ball rolling I'm gonna be honest with you I'm not not two weeks three weeks I'll say about two weeks so stay remember to so stay subscribed y'all if you haven't subscribed yet subscribe right now and uh, be stay tuned for one of those videos popping up very soon and then the next thing y'all is this one will be uh, way more soon I'm gonna do a uh, Sparkin Zero giveaway, y'all, for two Sparkin Zeros. Obviously, any consoles y'all have, Xbox, PlayStation, or PC, whichever you guys want, I will do be doing a um, Sparkin Zero giveaway. I'll be making a video, and I'll, I, I, I'll give y'all a dead, like a uh, where, where I plan to release this this video. I'll probably be in a week, so stay tuned. A week, I say, uh, four. Four days to a week for, that, right, to, for me to post the video. I'm actually doing it now, and I'm just gonna, you know, have it in the backlog just, just to say when I'm ready to post it. But I will be doing two game giveaways, y'all, and hopefully, uh, obviously, like I said, that's not to only help myself from subscribe. Like I, I'm, I'm be straight, 100% honest with y'all, uh, subscribers, viewers, and to help the tournament as well, because um, during the video. I will be announcing, obviously, promoting again the tournament that I'll be doing for subscribers so you don't have to pay, nothing like that. It's just, you gotta be subscribed and, and follow whatever I say. And then, um, and then obviously, I'll have the tournament, right? That you can, you guys can win your money if you're the best Sparking Zero contestant uh, in my tournament, right? So, um, so yeah, so stay for two for that. That's also to promote that as well. That, that's why I think. Obviously, people want the Sparking Zero game. Some people don't have the money, so I'll be doing a giveaway. And then also, with that, make, with me making that video, you will hear the tournament news as well. It's like, oh wow, I'm, he, he's I won the I won the contest, and he's doing the Sparking Zero tournament. Why not join? You know, why not? You know, why? Obviously, you will need a, a PayPal, um, uh, a Cash App, etc. Whatever, however, uh, you will be paid if you think you'll win. Obviously. You don't think you'll win but you still want to join come join and get your butt whooped if you guys want i guess right <laughs> but no you guys need to go for the win like i said a couple of my friends actually my a couple of my friends are gonna uh not a couple probably like two of my friends are gonna join this tournament so i need y'all not to let them win to be honest i need y'all to let, not let them win stay tuned for that y'all and i know i'm ta not talking about dokkan like i said this is just me you literally yapping and uh yeah i'm sorry if, you, if you're if you're respecting some dokkan talk I'm not, uh, I play a lot of Dokkan, but I'm not gonna say I'm the most, like, I, I read kits, I read, literally gotta read, read kit, kits all the time, I'm gonna be honest with y'all, and I know what certain teams, units do, obviously, since I've been playing the game for the beginning of the release, but I'm not gonna say my opinion is right, right, I, I like playing the game how I like, I like to play it, right, and, uh, if you guys have certain opinions about Dokkan, that's cool and all. I, I just enjoy the game. I, I just want to say that, right? Anyway, obviously I have opinions about Dokkan as well, right? But I think right now Dokkan's in a good spot. And that's literally about it. I mean, I don't, I don't know what else to talk about Dokkan beyond the truth. <laughs> Go to the truth. Sorry. Um, I guess we could talk about the Easy A. Cheering while we're, we're here. Uh, his Easy A, he has a Universe 11 or Universe Survival Saga. Category key plus three HP and attack and defense plus one seventy percent. That's the leader spell. It's not bad, to be honest. It's not bad. And then uh, he greatly raises the attack and defense for one turn, which is fifty percent, by the way. Causes the cost of the match to enemy and greatly lowers defense. Right. Ultra super attack uh, massively raises the attack and defense for one turn. Causes a mega colossal damage and massively lowers defense with a high chance of stunning the enemy. Attack and defense. Uh, his passive skill is a uh, value of victory. Uh, attack and defense plus three hundred percent. Reduces damage received by 30% for one turn from the start of character's entry turn. Plus an additional attack and defense plus 100 and guards all attacks when HP is 40 or more. Plus an additional attack and defense uh, 
plus 200% starting from the turn in the which character is HP is 40 or less from the start of turn or if HP is 80 or less starting from the fifth turn from the character's entry turn, right? Then key plus three, each attack received up to 11 uh, plus 11, launches an additional super attack starting from the turn in which the character received the third attack in battle. Attack effective against all types, form a critical hit to the target enemy is an attack down, defense down, status, or stun. Is able to uh, attack enemy action once within the turn when he is 24. Right? So I, I might be, I'm gonna be honest with you, uh, So far, she's always gave me three super attacks. Literally. I don't know if I'm lucky or uh, I know he gets one right, one uh, additional right. And then, then I have like, I think, I have no idea. I'm gonna be honest with you. I think I have 24 additional on him, I think. And it always procs for me, I'm gonna be honest. And then uh, his active skill is strength is everything. It's attack and defense plus 30%. All enemies, uh, attack and defense minus 30% and stuns all enemies for one turn. And it, it can be activated after the character receives attack five or more times in battle. Once only. Like I said, he's a pretty good unit. I actually don't even know where I will put him in the top 10. I'm gonna be honest. Um, do I have an opinion on that? Who is he better than? Um, I would, I would have to see a list on me, right? I kind of listed my top 10 units as well. Uh, it kind of has similarity to the truth. You guys see in his top 10. It's kind of similar. The only difference is I think I would put... Um, I think I would put a, uh, the, AG, the new AGL Jiren over this tech UI Goku. If I'm going to be honest. Just because this tech UI Goku never... And I mean never in his base form. Like dodges for me. I'm going to be honest with you. He always... I mean this these, this video, like I said. You guys see the, the, the great in him, right? Since posted it means i beat it some way somehow but for some reason he never dodges for me and uh he's most of, most of the time I'm, I'm dying because of him so i'm not saying he's a bad unit but uh i've been having more success with agl during so far so far right i'm hoping he can change but that so far that that's my opinion was with the truth i'll switch with that and then take take Jern i have zero idea i'm gonna be honest with you there's so many good units now y'all but yeah, check Jiren. Get him, get him ready. Like I said, I don't know <laughs> when these when these units will be coming to global. They should like they should do it before the worldwide uh, download celebration. You know, it's a joint celebration, and suppose it will be synced by then, or we will sync at that moment, right? And it's like, how are we gonna be synced when y'all are gonna still need like four? What is it? Three to four units still that's on GP and not on global. Like, how is that? How is that considered synced, right? I mean, I guess moving forward, it'll like every unit we get, we all get, right? So that's still synced, but at the same time, yeah, like I said, I, have, I can't explain what, what's gonna happen with these uh, characters. Obviously, you'll get them somehow. I don't think it will be, you guys, if you guys think it will be a joint banner, I'm sorry. You guys are expecting too much. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, just because these boys like money. These dog on death, this uh, toy or whoever runs this game loves money, right? But they love money so much, but they won't make another, uh, they won't bring back Dragon Ball Super, my fault. That's a whole nother matter. Ah, the whole, uh, since, you know, Chirame died, rest in peace, um, whole new, um, who gets the, like, the writer, I can't remember I, I, what I've seen, like, that's one of the big reasons why the manga is not coming back, and the anime won't come back anytime soon because of the, the license, licensing they're going through right now, like, uh, all the battles and stuff. The battle they're going through right now who, who gets the rights to i don't know if who gets the rights to the anime something like that right i don't want to get into it don't know the full details but i just know some, it's something along those lines and but i, but I know that these boys like money and they will not drop all these units these amazing units all these hype units with the cell max ui goku and jiren and oh, i'm sorry who, who, who am i missing who am i missing uh who am I missing? I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. Whoever else I'm missing, sorry. But those three units, they can literally put them on solo banners. Or like, put them on, you know, how they did. Or just put them on regular banners, right? And uh, they'll literally get top grossing, right? They sell Max will get top grossing on Global. Tech UI will get top grossing. In, but and Tajiran didn't get top grossing. But I, I just think because it's right between the lines of um, Worldwide Celebrations coming up very soon. And... Um, I think that's that's one of the reasons why it, it didn't get top grossing because people are, are actually smart and they're like let let me save that it's coming very soon right but i think if he came if journey came out like a month earlier he would have easily got came out with cell max like before cell max 
something like that along those lines, he would have got top girls 100%. Because he's hyped doing it, like I said. And, uh, other than that, yeah, I mean, Goku's in a good spot. Um, Summon for Beast Gohan. He's still the best unit, even though, um, mm, I haven't used him much, I'm gonna be honest with you, so I can't even stand it. But, yeah, so, so some of the way, my gym, my AGL gym is at, uh, uh, 79%, and then my, obviously, tech, the easy agent, he's been out for like a million years, and he's rainbowed. I actually went a couple more times. I, I, I did like two more multis on that banner, like without recording, and I got trashed. Kind of wish I saved that for the next banner that's coming up. It should come up on. By the way, the next banner, the next details for the banners, whichever drop before World. This is this is gonna be the last drop before Worldwide Celebration for uh, JP. It's gonna be um in, on Sunday. They're gonna show who's gonna be people are expecting it not to be hype but uh, I, I don't know delcon has been dropping heat lately people are expecting like a like a, um, a Dolcon fist krillin a Dolcon fist tm some, something along those lines where it's not like, like kind of like a well, yeah yamcha drop where it's not too hype i just feel like it's gonna be hype i, I think it's to be something like kid goku imagine they drop a kid goku i'm super super duper uh in love with dragon ball by the way like I'm, I'm obviously the series in general, but Dragon Ball, like, I know people are like the big explosions and big fights and big fight scenes. But I literally, in my opinion, this is my opinion, I literally can't pick what I like better, Dragon Ball or Dragon Ball Z. Like, I, I literally can't. That's how much I love Dragon Ball. I've, I've watched both of them a millions of times, and um, and I enjoy both of them for different reasons, right? And I, I, both, I think both of them are just amazing, I'm going to be honest. But Dragon Ball, it just has that nostalgia feeling. Like, more nostalgia than Dragon Ball Z to me. From just the, I guess, story aspect, right? And just seeing them as kids, just, I don't know. Pull, pulls a heartstring for me. I don't know why. I, I just don't know why. I never... I, I obviously, I put Dragon Ball Z over the series, over Dragon Ball series. But it's, like, not too far off. I don't know. Sometimes I'm like, not Dragon Ball. I just like Dragon Ball, you know? I, I mean, if you guys haven't watched it, I mean, it's been, like, a million years. <laughs> <laughs> but like you know like certain things like the um tambourine you know schmuck stepped on krillin's head pretty much and and i love the scene where he's just running and then messer stick stop stop you know because he knows he would die and he's like stop and then like that was like the first time goku like really like really didn't even like like he, he went tunnel vision mode right and it was just i don't know it was just so sad so hard like i don't know i just to me things in drug about just uh and then when he when he he hallucinated about krillin while well, he's eating he's not even hungry but he's not eating he's just, you know my fault my fault literally i was like yeah yeah like i said i told, told y'all i told y'all i'll be yapping i'll be yapping like i said y'all so let me stop yapping i'm gonna be honest with you let me stop yapping let me let y'all enjoy this video with no commentary um that's literally all the yapping uh, i think i have for today <laughs> have to say students but um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to like and subscribe, by the way. Um, let me know if you guys like these type of videos, right? These auto battle runs have been doing pretty good for me. And and that's one of the reasons why I continue to do this. I, I have no idea. Um, I have a couple comments on a couple of these videos. But you guys never, I mean, you guys never let me know if you guys do watch this. Let me know if you guys enjoy just me yapping. Or should I just stay on topic of, of something certain? Or do you guys like to hear me? Just yet and speak like while you know you guys watch Dokkan and see this, uh, you know, this broken team. You know, just let me know in the comment section as well. I obviously some feedback will help, and whatever you guys enjoy or post, I, I post videos because obviously I have fun making videos. I do not make any money posting these videos, by the way. So, um, so yeah, I just want to say that right now. I don't put that, I do this all. For fun and grind every single day and I post videos try to post every uh, videos every day if not every other day because I enjoy and I, I want to grow this community I want to um, be the likes of nanogenics uh, the truth C reacts afro rhyme style daughter doya etc etc I can go on and on youtubers I watch or the Dragon Ball youtubers I watch uh, or just the uh, anime right I you consider them anime kind of ish youtubers i watch i, I, I want to mean by saying i want to be the likes of them meaning 
uh, give y'all enjoyment, right? Give y'all all, all of them and every other single YouTuber you guys watch. Obviously, give you enjoyment. I hope I can do the same for you guys. You know, we can grow together and um, build this community strong. And uh, and we can do some fun things that I kind of want to get some uh, opinions on certain things, right? On um, video making, on what type of content you guys want to watch, and what type of uh, and and just and just listen to you guys on you know just opinions like oh maybe play this game, maybe play this game. You know, I've been thinking about doing a Dangaropa series, but I'm not gonna do that. Uh, if you guys were like, oh snap, do that. I'm not going to just yet. I'm gonna wait for the like uh, until maybe like around Christmas time or around January and beginning of the next year to maybe do that series if I do decide to do that. Um, but I do want to do a series and, and I kind of want to do that game like different and different, not Dragon Ball related. That's what I mean. I want to do a series that's not Dragon Ball related. But if I do that, it'll be by I'd say January because Fire Game Zero is about to come out. And this will be the busiest time of the year for me because I'm taking a week off of work. I'm a truck driver, but I'll be taking a week off of work. Uh, and, uh, <laughs> and I'll be playing a lot of Sparking Zero. And I'll be posting a lot of videos of Sparking Zero. Literally, I'm, I'm going to try to beat the campaign in one day. Like, you know, it, 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 I, mean, I don't know if I'm going to beat it in one day, I'm going to be honest with you. I, I want to enjoy it. But I'll think I'm going to do, do more than one run on, on the campaign. But I'll, I'm, I'm try to be the first in everything, right? Or not even the first in everything. Just post different type of content, Sparking Zero content. I'll be posting a lot of Sparking Zero. I might even be posting two to three times a day when Sparking Zero first releases for the first like month. So stay tuned for that. If you're here for Dokkan content, stay tuned for that. Subscribe. If you're here for Dragon Ball Legends content, subscribe, y'all. Even though um I might not be summoning for Omega Shinra, I, I did do a couple summons. Might just post that in short. But other than that. Come here with Dragon Ball content, anime content. I have other anime stuff I want to do. Eventually, I want to do like oh my top ten anime, with my recommendations for anime. Like I said, let me let me give you a recommendation now. Watch. I always give this. I think I've done this in a couple of videos. For this recommendation. Watch. I'll talk fast. By the way, I talk fast. And uh, yeah, uh, watch 91 Days. That's the anime. That's what the anime is called. 91 Days. It's 11 episodes. You guys can literally binge watch it. It's a really good anime. I really love that anime. I'm gonna be honest with you. And let's hit you with a, a, a big, um, a famous, right, a famous uh, anime, right, or a, a mainstream anime. We'll go watch Full uh, Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. That's another one. Literally my uh, keypad or whatever, whatever you want to call it. Mouse pad, right? Sick. I love the anime. Anyway, this is Xenoworks. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video once again. And uh, enjoy the rest. And I'll catch you in the next video.